Hello everyone, I am Advocate Akhil Solaki, associate with Dialyzy. So in this video we are going to discuss about the death penalty <coughs> against humanity. So punishing the accused is important but taking the life away is not the solution to mark a difference between him and us would be to be understand the nature of human rights in the common interest of all. So the concept of death penalty is existing in India since decades whether it was a, a dynasty rule era of the Mughals or British Raj and the, or post independence death penalty is way used to administer justice. So the United Nations on the other hand by its uh, charter of rights declared that death penalty or capital punishment is a crime against humanity and has requested the country's uh, member of the UN to get it abolished. So India <coughs> precisely is a member of UN but India has still not abolished or abandoned the practice of death penalty. This is quite contrary to very basic structure of the constitution of India. Article 21 precisely states that the government has no right to take away life. Article 21, one of the fundamental rights of constitution of India guarantees right to life. So India maintains its own stand on death penalty and uh, moratorium at the UN General Assembly and in India execution is carried out in the rarest of the rare cases. So <coughs> death penalty or capital punishment, when a person commits crime it is punishable under the law. Death penalty is a legal way wherein an accused is put to death by the state for the commission of a crime committed by him. So the death penalty or the capital punishment is the legal penalty or the punishment for the crime as committed. The process of punishing the person or accused through a judicial decree is referred to as death sentence. So thank you. See you next video with some more information.